One of the more confusing concepts for new patients and their families dealing with a diagnosis of cancer is understanding the difference between grade and stage. Cancer grade is basically a measure of how aggressive cancer cells appear under a microscope. Grade 1 tumors, also known as low grade, are the least aggressive. They look a lot like the cells from which they arose, like a lung, breast, or prostate cell. Generally, they grow slowly, and sometimes patients with grade 1 cancers can avoid extra treatments like radiation after surgery. Grade 2 tumors are more aggressive than grade 1, and sometimes are called intermediate grade. Under the microscope, they begin to take on odd-appearing shapes, indicating they're beginning to grow faster. Grade 3 tumors are the most aggressive, often called high-grade cancer and they have acquired so many mutations, they look almost nothing like the cell from which they arose. Sometimes doctors add extra treatments after surgery to protect patients against aggressive tumors from growing back. Usually, information about cancer grade is used to decide whether or not a patient needs additional treatment after the primary treatment for cancer, for instance, chemotherapy or radiation after surgery. Generally, however, cancer grade is not the determining factor for which primary treatment makes the most sense for a patient. For example, which treatment gets used out of the gate, like surgery or radiation. The decision regarding the best primary treatment is generally based on cancer stage, not grade. This is not medical advice. Talk to your doctor before making any medical decisions.